Hello guys, how are you? This is Fran. I'm gonna show you today how I cook my eggs, uh, my eggs whites. Uh, again, uh, I love eggs and um, I'm having uh, uh, at the moment uh, pasteurized, uh, you know, free range uh, egg whites. Same reason as I explained, uh, you know, in my video on the grill and on the chicken. Um, I tend to have like free range or organic biologic, uh, you know, source of protein because that's safer, uh, at least I mean uh, for the last uh, few weeks before my competition. Uh, anyway, you know, this brand should be familiar with you, is Egg Nation, uh, so you can buy them online. You've probably seen a lot of, you know, Coleman videos with, uh, you know, uh, Coleman having this type of egg whites. It's a good brand, but also here in the UK I'm having the same egg whites from uh, another brand called Two Chicks, and also the egg whites from uh, myprotein.co.uk. So, uh, you know, it's pretty simple, uh, it comes as frozen, then you have to put it in the fridge if you want to use it, and once it's uh, liquid again, you can use it for within seven days, uh, otherwise you can keep it in the freezer, and it stays in the freezer, I think, uh, about two or three months, something like that. So, one uh, egg white, so one medium egg white is the equivalent of 20, uh, 30 milliliter and uh, six medium egg whites is 180 milliliters. Uh, what I do is, uh, you know, just to simplify that, I mean, it's usually, what I have is uh, about 25, 30 grams of protein, so it's about like a glass, a normal glass of, you know, egg whites. But I bought this pump and, uh, you know, uh, each pump is about uh, one medium egg white. So I'm gonna have eight pumps um, here in the saucepan uh, to get uh, 250 milliliters or something like that uh, so 25 30 grams of protein here we go so the saucepan is hot um, um, I have to do it again bilingual um, so ecco qua la padella è, è calda uh, quindi uso un po' di uh, olio per evitare che si attacchino le uova here we go, you know, with some sunflower oil. And then uh, I take my dispenser here. Well, how am I going to do it? <laughs> All right. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> That's fun. Six, seven, eight. Right. About eight pumps in the otto spruzzi che rappresentano otto bianchi e quindi più o meno 24 uh, 30 grammi di proteine. So eight pumps uh, equivalent to uh, 24 30 grams of protein. Just wait for a couple of minutes. Aspettiamo due minuti. And here we go, you know, uh, you know, eggs can be done in, in several different ways. Um, um, I was actually going to prepare my lunch for tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow is my low carbs day, so I'm about 100 grams of carbs. Uh, so I have here 200 grams of uh, quinoa and uh, my uh, eight w um, egg whites. Quindi domani um, uh, le uova si possono fare in tanti modi, eh, in questo caso uh, visto che ne ho approfittato devo fare il pranzo per domani ho preparato già la ciotola per il pranzo per domani e in questa box eh, ho 200 grammi di quinoa cotta eh, e eh, appunto i miei otto bianchi d'uovo eh, quindi domani è un giorno a carbo basso eh, quindi circa 100 grammi di carbs e, e quindi in questo caso abbiamo eh, più o meno 42 grammi eh, di carboidrati dalla quinoa e poi 30 grammi eh, di ehm, proteine dalle uova e poi ho aggiunto anche eh, questo olio di cocco eh, che è ottimo eh, al posto appunto dell'olio normale, l'olio d'oliva o l'olio di semi di lino eh, è appunto un olio particolare, si può fare un video a parte su questo in realtà eh, quindi ha acidi grassi a catena eh, media che quindi vengono metabolizzati direttamente dal fegato e utilizzati come energia quindi in giorni di cardio ehm, di carbo scusate eh, basso sono ottimi eh, soprattutto se eh, si segue poi l'allenamento 
so guys just for the English speaking uh, you know listener and watchers I added also here uh, you know some extra virgin coconut oil uh, just one uh, uh, tablespoon so this is great uh, I will probably do just a separate video on that but it's uh, MCT so mid-chain uh, um, uh, fat acid so it's great as a source of energy because it's uh, immediately metabolized by your liver as a source of energy compared to other uh, type of oils and uh, you know it's also great taste and uh, finally uh, the final touch uh, my favorite is actually ground cinnamon uh, this is actually a tip from uh, another friend bodybuilder uh, Milo uh, Mr. White uh, who basically suggested you know using cinnamon on uh, um, you know eggs and in fact I mean eggs get a tremendously good uh, flavor with cinnamon so I'm just gonna put some here there we go so yeah this is my meal for tomorrow you can smash them you can you know just stir it and do whatever you want but yeah these are pretty much you know uh, the final meal so 200 grams of quinoa uh, cooked quinoa so about 42 grams of carbs uh, my eight uh, eggs white so about 25 30 grams of protein uh, one tablespoon of coconut oil in the uh, come dicevo uh, ho aggiunto anche il cinnamon, uh, quindi la cannella e questo è un, uh, un tip, uh, un suggerimento che mi è stato dato da, da Milo, Mr. White, uh, Milo Fainello che è un amico bodybuilder che fa le gare con me uh, anche per la NBFA infatti la, la cannella su, sulle uova uh, ci sta veramente da Dio, sta, è veramente buona quindi in questo caso il mio pranzo per domani corrisponde a 200 g di quinoa cotto, cotta quindi 42 g di carboidrati eh, i miei 8 bianchi d'uovo quindi dai 25 ai 30 g di proteine e un tablespoon di ehm, un cucchiaio da cucina di olio di cocco eh, che ovviamente è 14 g di grassi perfetto, alla prossima, ciao!